Mr. Speaker, I'm pleased to join with other parliamentarians in welcome Mr. Kato Akatsang to Ottawa today. The new representative to North America of His Holiness the Dalai Lama, our distinguished honorary citizen. The painful plight of Tibetans, where more than 120 from all sectors of society have self-immolated, is the ultimate cry of protest and witness against the ongoing persecution and repression. Mr. Speaker, Tibetans value democracy, freedom, religious liberty, and the rule of law, while adhering to nonviolence in the pursuit of genuine autonomy pursuant to the Chinese constitution. Regrettably, while Chinese President Xi Jinping speaks of transparency in the rule of law, the repression of political dissent, silencing of independent media, and criminalization of innocence has with the Tibetans intensified. These actions shame a superpower that is a trustee of a great Chinese civilization and heritage. We urge the Chinese authorities to respect that great heritage, respect the rule of law, and to see the Dalai Lama as a solution for a just and lasting peace for China and all Tibetans. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.